Hey, good morning, fellow wet shavers. It's JR here from North Kakalaki. Uh, Thanksgiving week. Today is Tuesday, and uh, this week I'm doing uh, my new 3D printed printer, 3D printed razors from Roger Quintero. Uh, today I'm up to what he calls the AC Matic. It has a handle that looks like a bullet tip and uh, uses an AC blade. The uh, handle opens it up like this. You see there? You see the blade inside? I'm not going to take it out, but I'm going to. All right, we're going to be shaving with this today. Today is Tuesday, so that means it's Tobacco Tuesday going to be leathering the tobacco with my Jara number one the number one brush first one I ever made uh, finish off with some tobacco aftershave so we're going to get started here by putting a little cold water in the sink as we do cold water shaves here in North Kakalaki okie dokie We're going to start by wetting the brush and then wetting the face. There we go. Wet the brush, wet, wet the brush, wet the face. We're going to load the brush. Six, seven, eight, about 10 seconds. And then we're gonna go straight to the base. No need for a bowl. Oh yeah. I love the tobacco. That's one of the soaps that I will uh, replace. There we go. Oh. Show you my case. I made a little case for the for the um, asigmatic, looks like that. I'll show you. Put it in there. So there we go. Asigmatic. See what we get here. Oh yeah. I shave with the uh, Inject TR Injector ver Version 1 yesterday, which is similar to this. Uh, the head is because, uh, but the handle's a little different. And it uses a regular injector blade. But uh, this AC blade is really cool. Man, this is a wonderful shaver. Roger, you have outdone yourself on this one, buddy. I really like this. I have a, a King Cobra and a Cobra Classic, which uses the AC blade, but, uh, you know, I like this even better. <laughs> Wow, what a, what a first pass. Okay, let's go for the second pass. Yeah. Mm. Second pass is against the grain. Wow, Roger, this is great. Mm. 
Oh, the nice thing about these is they get under the nose really well. All right, let's see now what we got left over here. I usually have, yeah, yep. I had the same thing with the injector uh, version one. Is I do have a little touch up underneath the jawline, which I usually do, but. Man, it's hardly noticeable at all. Nothing. Good job, Roger. Good job. Okay, we're going to do a cold water rinse. And then finish off with some uh, tobacco aftershave. Oh yeah, very good. Cold water, hot water is still coming from the other end of the house. Use the hot water, rinse out my brush, clean up my razor. There we go. Still a little cold. All right, starting to warm up a little bit. Takes about 45 seconds to get here from the other end of the house. Oh yeah, there we go. Alright, go brush dry or paint dry the brush. So there it is, it's ready to go for tomorrow. And I'm going to open this up just a little bit so I can get Get the water down in the, inside the blade there. Okay. All right. Now I'm going to open it up, open it up, open it up. And uh, there's the blade. AC blade. And there's the razor. You can see. And uh, it's got little uh, tabs in the top of the head. So when you drop the razor in, or drop the blade in the head. Whoops. I'm doing this left-handed. Yeah, you just drop it in there and then start cranking the head down and those little tabs go inside the holes. That's what holds it in place. So that thing is ready to go for its own week got five of these razors uh, this week I'm using one a day one for each day and then uh, after this week I'm going to use each razor for five days so that's what I got planned that's December okay to back aftershave there we go all right thanks for watching this is jr i am clean smooth and refreshed i hope you all have a wonderful thanksgiving we have so much to be thankful for beam me up scotty bye bye